We're standing at the corner of Palmetto and St. Nicholas intersection and we're going to look at some old trolley tracks. Uh, they're doing some construction work down here at the bus depot and I have a feeling they're going to be paving the road and uh, once they pave that road these tracks will be lost forever so let's just go over here and see what we have. This is uh, where the tracks start, I'm right under Palmetto Street, right under, under the L. And this is about the best you could see. I need to pan out a bit. And I'm as wide as I can go. Uh, and you also over here see some cobblestones. Now, I don't expect this. Now, I think some someone straight, straight down there to the bus depot, and then you follow these this track here this makes a turn and this goes on to st. Nicholas and it disappears here and then if you look down there that's Myrtle Avenue I guess it connected into Myrtle Avenue now I just crossed the street and this is uh, the tracks pick up here right at the intersection a pretty good shot of them it's not good. it's get a close-up metal is just all worn down. I guess they've been here for over a hundred years. Yeah. Snow is melting. We had a snowstorm a few days ago. And kind of a makeshift job here. And then it continues down Palmetto. Cobblestone. Get out of the way before I get hit. And this is the end of it. Metal is just torn off. And the track heads down there under the L to Palmetto. Uh, right under Palmetto, rather. And that's it. And this is the, uh, the bus depot. And they are renovating it. And the most noticeable difference is they put this canopy awning right over my head, if you can see. It has some slots uh, of clear plastic, so you get some sunlight in. But otherwise, this is great, because I used to stand here for the bus, and uh, you'd get soaking wet if it were raining. But now they do uh, have an awning over there. And they're putting up new bus signs, as you can see. And these signs haven't even been uncovered yet. They're brand new. And a welcome addition is some city because they never had seats and you always just had to wait. So this is right by the, uh, the 58. So if you're waiting for the 58, you can actually uh, grab a seat. Some more signs that they haven't opened yet. And they did put a, uh, a modernized uh, building for the workers there. It used to be a little shack, as, it, as I remember. So this is still, this is still in the works. You can see the, uh, the barriers here. And a lot of construction workers going on. Again, more signs. Some guys working over there, and some signs that are still uncovered. And then right above is the tracks of the M train.